it's me again, Dee, and welcome back to my channel. I decided to create a series of my CapCut tutorials. And this time, I'm going to share something that you can still do on the app, and that is how to loop your videos or your audio files or music using the app. So if you guys are interested, keep on watching because Dee explores CapCut. If you're familiar with TikTok creator Christian Kesniel, you probably know that he is an awesome TikTok creator and is a definitely king when it comes to creating looping videos. I'm aware that he uses a different app when editing his videos, but I decided to create a version for those who only has access to a free app, and in this case, it's CapCut. So here's a video that I created and I tried to somehow loop the clip. I only use the CapCut app to edit this and I'll be sharing some tips on how you can create your own looping video. Here are four tips in looping your clips. Tip number one is to use a similar start and end frame. As you can see here, the start of my video is exactly similar to the end of my video. And that is me walking in the frame. Tip number two is to use a tripod when shooting your clips. This is very helpful to avoid shaky videos, maintain stability, and similar framing. When I shot these clips, I only mounted my camera on a tripod and I got no help from anyone. I just made use of the CapCut keyframes to mimic camera movements. If you want to know more about this, I'll be placing a card for you to check out. Tip number three is to use the correct music timing. Make sure that your music does not start or end in an awkward position. See to it that you can come up with a smooth transition for your music. Lastly, tip number four is to let your creative juices flow. You can do so much with CapCut. I also made use of the masking tool when I created this video. If you want to know more about masking, I also created a separate tutorial for this. tutorial if you guys have any specific requests or any questions related to CapCut then please let me know by leaving a comment below and if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up share if that's something that you like and if you're still not part of this community then don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell beside it so you'll get notified whenever there's a new video up in this channel and I hope to see you on my next CapCut tutorial till the next one keep exploring bye